Good day, it's Tony Fortunato from the Technology Firm. Today I want to share a little tip with you. People seem to like these little tips and tricks I use every day. This is a add-on for Chrome and it's called Mercury Reader and it's free. And what it does, it's quite easy. It, it takes uh, any web page and turns it into a proper article format without all the extra noise that you would normally see when you go to an article. So. Uh, you just get it, you add it to Chrome, right? It's added, and then you get this little rocket ship up here, and you just click it whenever you need it. So I'm going to show you. Let's just go to network computing, for example. This has a whole bunch of stuff. Not just, it's not just an article, right? This is the main page. I just want to show you what happens if you try to do too much with the tool. So you're going to come here and click the little rocket, click, and it says, hey, warning, Merc Mercury Reader works best on an individual articles are you sure and you can render it anyways or cancel I'm going to cancel that so this is what happens when you don't have an article or there's just way too much going on you can force it but you might want to double check what it does when you're when you're done with it so I'm going to actually pick an article this is uh, one from Microsoft um, and these are kind of neat, these little articles. Now, if you scroll all the way to the bottom, when you look on the left-hand side, you'll see Download PDF. That's going to download the entire document. And sometimes I don't want the document. I just want, for example, SNMB reads and writes second. And that's all I want, right? I, I don't need all the other nonsense. So I'm going to hit my little rocket ship. And it goes and it renders the page. And now, you know, with the exception of this, this big image here, the rest of it is actually fairly good format you see nice and clean all the way down and there you go so the first time you use this on a website I would strongly encourage you to just look at the bottom of the page first then use the mercury reader button and make sure it got the entire page and nine out of ten times it works just perfectly but you don't want to assume it worked and then find out later it did not so now that you have it in mercury uh, reader you have a few options right at the bottom here you can see there's there's an email you got good old Twitter, Facebook, or in Chrome if you want, you can just do the old print feature and then save to PDF and then just save it as a PDF format, right? And there you go. See that? So I hope that helps. I, I do this a lot because I read a lot of articles. Sometimes I want them offline for just reference or just, you know, whenever I want to read it sort of thing. Um, and that's it. Have a good day. Bye for now, folks. Thank <laughs> you.